The city of Warwick has determined where their 33 million ARPA dollars are going. The city council met last night and voted to approve several projects. Mayor Frank Bacosi says the city needs to, uh, to be dictating the spending. 12 News reporter Brittany Schaefer sat down with the mayor today and has more on what that money is being invested in. Mayor Frank Bacosi says the federal dollars are going to places where residents voice their concerns, like fixing public roads, upgrading public safety, and adding more garbage trucks. $33 million of American Rescue Plan dollars rescuing the needs of Warwick. Oh, this helps so much. Gives us a great start. $2.5 million is set aside for revenue loss brought on by the pandemic, leaving a lot of room for other projects. Purchase things like garbage trucks, fire trucks, rescues. Uh, we're spending on infrastructure, water, and sewer. We're doing more paving in Warwick than it's ever been done before. We have four companies doing it right now. Picozzi calling the money a huge blessing for an old city. $7 million is is going towards the Bayside sewer project that hasn't been touched for 25 years. The water transmission line project under Route 95 has been delayed for four years due to costs. Now it's getting three million ARPA dollars. Another aging aspect in the city, the fleet of both garbage and fire trucks. Well, it was a big concern because I mean, our fleet was very old. They've been let go for a long time. We didn't rotate new trucks in and out. We have uh, rescues that are used uh, past their n normal span of time that should be used. We have to to have a, a plan in effect to um, uh, replace our apparatus and so the opera funds are going to help us uh, accomplish that goal. Pocosi said councilors spoke to community groups and were given $200,000 to use in their district on things like park benches and fixing playgrounds. The city is also using federal dollars to build an outdoor skating rink and event center behind City Hall. It's going to be called City Hall Plaza. It's going to be a roller skating rink in the summer. We're going to have um, we're going to have food truck events there, dances in, in, in the wintertime to be just like the, the Providence skating rink. Impicosi tells me the new fire trucks and emergency response vehicles will arrive at some point next year due to the supply shortage. In Warwick, I'm Brittany Schaefer, 12 News.